Hey, so today we're going to go over how to publish a book on Babel Cube. Now, obviously we have quite a few books on here already, but we're going to scroll all the way to the bottom and hit add a new book. So, so once you're on this page, you're going to go ahead and fill out the information on your book. I've already gone ahead and done it, but to get you through it, you're going to put your title, your subtitle, and your author. You are going to put your cover image and then a one line description. Now, now, I had this highlighted and I actually just took this line and put it up here as the one line description because what you're going to want to put is something that's sort of catching. I figured this would be a good line to start the description off with. And then I pasted my description in here. One thing to keep in mind is sometimes the formatting comes out a little silly. It's okay. Super easy to fix. Boom. Um, the next is you get two categories to put your book into. I looked up trading and I looked up stocks and I took the most general ones that I could for this particular book um, because you're going to want it to be nice and far reaching so that you can get a good amount of interest in your book. And then we scroll down the language that your book is currently written in, which is English for this book. Uh, you have your keywords. Now, you do have to type them in individually, but you should already have your keywords ready. So you just go ahead and type them in, separate them by a comma, and then they'll pop up in these little things. And then these keywords will also be translated in the process, which is nice. So try and cover as much as you can. We have a word count, which I just pulled up my Word document. It gave me a number. And then the sample text. Now, it does ask... Um, if you have any information about your book sales and rankings, so if you've been selling these books and they're doing really well, this would be the place that you're going to want to put that information in. And then we have book sample text. Now, I go ahead and just pull a little bit from the middle of the book that I feel like is an interesting little bit of information. Maybe not like super long because it has to be under... 2000 characters so this is 1818 it's right under 2000 it's perfect and then it wants an amazon page now if you have any other pages or websites like a facebook page or anything like that this is where you would link those so you do have to have an amazon book page like babble cube only allows books that are already listed on amazon so you have to go ahead and put that in. But you, if you don't have a book website or a fan page, don't worry about that. Now, say you didn't want to put your book in a certain language, say you already have it written in Spanish, so you don't want somebody to give you a Spanish translation, you could go ahead and add that translation into this list here. And we're not going to go ahead and do that because... We're open to all the languages. If somebody wants to translate it into German or French or Hindi, Spanish, whatever they want to translate it into, we're open to that. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just add the book here. And then that's it. So at this point, that book is now open to translations. People can go ahead and offer their translation. Like you can see, we have 39 messages on this account. Those are all translations. When I open this up, you can see that we have a whole lot being offered, some in progress. We have a few that need to be checked. And at that point, these books are already ready to push through and go through to the finished books. And then these are our finished books. So we have a couple books, as you can see here, that are ready to be published. I'm going to go ahead and go through that real quick with you. Now, this was another stock market investing book. But since I don't have the cover already ordered yet, what I would do is go ahead and go here. So I now have my translated title. I have my translated subtitle. So then I'm going to go to my designer and have them set up a gig for me to translate the book cover that I already have into a new translated book cover with the same image. As you can go down here, I have the translated keywords and phrases. If there's a collection, like it's part of a series, they would you would have put it in here, and they would have translated that as well. And everything else is ready. 
So we're going to push through to the next one. I would put in my book cover image here, the publisher, and the copyright holder would be the author. Um, so in this case, it's Odin Velez. And then the book's main translated text. So you can download this um, here just to get a little bit of fine tuning. For the most part, they're going to be formatted fine. And then going forward, as we look up here, I can't go through without another cover image, but you would upload the Word file. Now, the nice thing about Babelcube is it does take the Word file and it actually goes ahead and just converts it for you so you don't need to format in another language. Um, I've done that. It takes quite a bit of time. And the Babelcube finished uh, product does come out very good. But once you're once it's all said and done, you can go ahead and you click through to the Word file and it'll tell you, do you want to use the one that is provided here? This is how you download it. And you can always download these for your own files. The final files that is going to be the converted file from Babelcube it comes out um, ready in an EPUB format. And then they'll also do a print copy. And then the book price, we usually set them around $2.99 for an ebook and around $16 for a, a, a print book. But for now, since I don't have the cover and I can't really move past this page without it, I'm just going to back back out to our main page here. And yeah, that's it. It is very simple, even though we didn't go through the steps to actually publish a book today. It is just clicking, dragging and dropping, making sure you have all the files ready. Putting books on here is as easy as just copying and pasting the information over. But as far as Babelcube goes, that is about it. I mean, everything is pretty much laid out right in front of you. You have all of your books, you have all your translators, your translations. It's all super easy to click through from your profile. Um, once you get started, it, it's so hands off. You just need to put the books up there and wait for some responses. Sometimes it'll take about a week, but they will start reaching out to you.